Hi, welcome to this demonstration. In this video, we will take a look at Cloud Firewall, an integrated component of the Sky High Security Service Edge platform. Given the increasing trend of users accessing business applications remotely from diverse locations directly through the cloud, the vulnerability to corporate assets is on the rise. SkyHack Cloud Firewall ensures the security of access to internet-based applications and resources enabling accessibility from any site or location utilizing a cloud-native service model. SkyHack Cloud Firewall integrates a cloud-based firewall solution with our Security Service Edge platform, providing multi-layer protection and deep packet inspection capabilities. This empowers organizations with enhanced visibility, precise policy enforcement, and comprehensive control over their applications to effectively counter potential threats. Leveraging the Sky High Cloud Firewall enables you to oversee all outbound network traffic and prevent unauthorized access through the enforcement of firewall policies. Moreover, the Sky High Cloud Firewall ensures secure monitoring of outbound traffic leaving your organization across all ports and protocols, irrespective of user, location, or office. Policies can be customized based on parameters such as IP, host, domain, port, user group, and process, aligning seamlessly with the Sky High SSE policies. The system is adept at detecting HTTP and HTTPS traffic even on non-standard ports, efficiently routing such traffic to the Sky High Secure Web Gateway Cloud Service for meticulous inspection. Let's pivot over to the Sky High Security Console, and in this demonstration, we start with the Sky High Client Proxy Policy. In this example, we have disabled web traffic redirection from the client to the service and instead have enabled the cloud firewall setting and are opting to send all traffic from the client to the platform. We have also configured some destination exclusions for internal IP address ranges since our intent is to only control outbound traffic from the client to the internet. Cloud Firewall policy allows you to control how the firewall inspects, allows, or denies network traffic. Each firewall is associated with a single policy, but a policy can be associated to multiple sets of rules. You can define rules based on source and destination IP addresses, host names, location names, port numbers, names of detected protocols, process names, and even users or groups. Furthermore, a cloud firewall seamlessly integrates with web policy to provide an additional layer of security for web traffic, which we will demonstrate with this rule for web traffic that allows and applies web policy at the same time. Let's also demonstrate another protocol besides web traffic. So to test that, we'll have a destination server that is listening for SSH on port 443 and 22, while also listening for HTTPS traffic on port 443, which will route to a web application listening on a non-standard web port on the same server. We'll use our client to connect to the server and show the policy's ability to detect the proper pr protocols and apply the appropriate policies. As traffic is sent to the cloud firewall and passed to the cloud proxy for deeper web inspection, here is a quick look at the web policy where we will demonstrate some of the basic protection features like URL filtering, remote browser isolation, data protection, and anti-malware scanning. Let's switch over to our test client, and here you can see we have the Sky High client deployed, connected to a POP, and configured to send all traffic to the cloud firewall. Our policy for web traffic is to allow and apply web policy together so you can see that the user is able to successfully browse the web but gets blocked if they try to access a gambling site. We'll also browse to our testing website here where the user tries to download an archive containing sample malware and is met with a block page showcasing anti-malware scanning in action. Our web policy is also configured to apply RBI if a website is not secure, so here we switch the site to an HTTP version and observe Sky High Security's pixel mapping RBI technology in action. And finally, our web policy also has DLP enabled to block any uploads that contain sensitive information, so here the user tries to upload an image of a financial report, but with object character recognition and DLP policies enabled, the user is not able to upload the file. Now let's browse to our demo server that is listening for both web traffic and SSH on port 443. Here you can see the user access the web application, but when they try to click on the signup page, they are met with a block page demonstrating again the Cloud Firewall's policy ability to allow and apply web policy at the same time. 
Next, we'll open our SSH client and the current policy is set to allow SSH on port 443 and block on port 22. So first we try port 443 with our client and we can see a successful SSH login. However, upon trying port 22 with the client, the user observes a connection timeout, which proves the policies are functioning correctly. Let's now go back to the cloud firewall policy and change it such that we simply just allow web traffic without applying any web policy and we'll also flip the SSH access so that we now block port 443 but allow SSH on port 22. Back to our test client and the user makes another request to our web application and are still allowed of course but this time if the user tries to use the sign up link they successfully can since there is no web policy being applied to block the actual link. And if we test our SSH access again, we should correctly observe that SSH over 443 to the server is now blocked, while port 22 has been allowed successfully. Sky High Security's Cloud Delivered Firewall provides fast, secure access to cloud and internet resources and workloads from anywhere in the world. Thanks for taking the time to watch this video.